In this video, we will show you how to clean the sidewalls and bath surface in the Westomat, which is best done once per shift. For your own safety, please wear adequate protective clothing. The cleaning and control door is located on the back of the Westomat. The door can only be opened in pairs. Only by activation of the button, unlock the cleaning door, can the door be opened. You pull out the safety bar and move the hoop guard aside. When the door is opened, the heating will be turned off automatically via the door locking switch. Then you open the locking handle. You open the door wide enough for the hoop guard to snap in at the opposite side. The support for the cleaning tool is set in the corresponding slot. You use the scraper for the cleaning of the sidewalls and for the bath surface, the rake. The tools need to be warmed up and dry, as well as free of oil and grease, before you bring them into contact with the molten material or the wall of the furnace. Now you can start with the actual cleaning. First, you clean the walls of the refractory lining and remove the existing material deposits. Remove the aluminum oxide from the surface of the metal bath and pull it to the center in front of the cleaning door. Now you fix the assembly frame to the door hinge and on the opposite side with the press spindle. You screw in on the launder tightly with another person. Via the launder you can safely move the residue into the dross container in front of the cleaning door. If the door seal shows traces of wear, then it is time to change it. After the door is relocked, the heating will turn on automatically. But to be on the safe side, you should check this on the control cabinet. 